Hello girls and boys. Welcome back to Read Me a Story. And hello also to my grandchildren, Max, Theo, Josephine, Charlotte, Penelope, and Simon. And girls and boys, I want to tell you about my book first. This is what I wrote. I'm the author. It's called Tips and Tidbits for Parents and Teachers. So it's for your moms and dads to read. And they can get it from amazonbooks.com. And it will tell them all about the things I learned in my 50 years of teaching in the classroom. And it will help them to help you at home. So, amazonbooks.com. I hope they can order it. Now, girls and boys, today is a really special day because I have something you probably will not believe. I have a book that is my, that was my first reader when I went to school. And my mother was my teacher. Yeah. And so that's why I have the book. Now, this is called Fun with Dick and Jane. So we have Dick the boy and Jane his sister and then their little baby sister Sally. And we have their pet dog Spot and their pet cat Puff and Sally's little stuffed animal teddy bear Tim. This is Tim. So we have him here today. Now here's the amazing thing about Dick and Jane readers. They're back. If your mommy goes into um, any big bookstore, she will be able to find you now. Dick and Jane books. So I'm just going to read you the first one to tell you that they're back and to show you um, what these stories look like. When you find them in the store, some of them are just little <coughs> glossy books and the writing is quite big, the printing is quite big. This one's called Family Fun. So, you can read along with me today. So here's how girls and boys started reading when I was a little girl, and it hasn't changed. These books were so good that they have now brought them back years and years later. Please read with me. I will go slowly. Here we go. See it go. Look, said Dick. See it go. See it go up. And there's the airplane going up. Jane said, Oh, look. See it go. See it go up. Up, up, said Sally. Go up, up, up. So now we see Sally, and Jane is her older sister, and we even saw Spot watching the plane go up with Dick. Jane said, down, down, down it comes. Run, Dick, we can find it. See me run, said Sally. See Spot run. Oh, oh, this is fun. So you can see, girls and boys, that they're going to try and get this plane that's coming down. Now look what happens. Oh, look, said Dick, it is father. Oh my, father looks funny. Jane said, my, my, this is not fun. This is not fun for father. Look what the plane did to father. What a surprise for him. So that's the very short story. And the next one is called Guess. So the whole family is going to play a guessing game. Guess. Dick said, guess, mother. Guess, guess. Mother said, I can guess. It is Dick. Yes, yes, said Sally. It is Dick. Who is this, said father. Can you guess who it is? Mother said, it is not Dick. It is not Jane and not Sally. I can guess who it is. It is father. Yes, yes, said Jane. It is father. Jane said, guess, mother. Guess who it is. 
Mother said, I can guess. It is Jane. No, no, said Sally. No, no, no. Oh my, this is fun. Mother cannot guess. I can guess, said Mother. I can guess who it is. It is Baby Sally. Yes, yes, said Dick. It is Baby Sally. Funny little Sally. Oh, look, said Mother. My family is here. My funny, funny family. All right, so we'll leave it there, girls and boys. So all the stories are very short, and I hope that you were able to read along with me today. Wonderful. So, Dick and Jane helps you to learn how to read. These are for sight words. And girls and boys at home, it's very helpful if you have a piece of paper or a card that's called a marker, and you put it under each line, and that helps your eye to keep on track. And then you don't have to use your fingers for pointing to each word. And your reading will be so much smoother. We call that fluent. All right, girls and boys, see you next time for Read Me a Story. And girls and boys, remember to press Read More, See More, the sign on your computer that says there are many more stories that I have put on for you. So join me again for Read Me a Story. Bye for now.